Hey, uh, my lovely daughter-in-law, Hannah, got me this for Father's Day. So I'm gonna give that a go, make some baby donuts. Um, the problem was trying to find a recipe because there wasn't a recipe in with it. And I can find recipes for doing in a frying pan, or a, you know, deep fat fryer, but not one where you pour it into a machine. I finally found a recipe, so I'm gonna give that a go and see if it works. Let's get started. To begin, I want three eggs. Next, chuck in 100 grams of sugar. And get that mix in. Now it says add 120 grams of flour, but it doesn't say what sort. So I've got this. Now, one teaspoon of baking powder. 15ml of milk and lastly 60 grams of melted butter. Here's my little funky machine. I have the little plates, you've got a button there and they pop out for easy cleaning. So that's good. Right, we've got a little bit of cooking oil here. So a little bit on each little plate. And turn it on. Wait for the little light to go off. Light's gone off. Well, I poured it in probably about five minutes ago. Nothing seems to have come back on or happened. So I'm not sure what's going on. Um, the light has now come back on again. So something is happening. That was about another two minutes have gone by now. And the light's now come back on. So. I think I'm going to take these out and put some more in and see what happens. Um, now, I'm no expert on donuts. So I don't know whether this is done or not done or what. My wife was telling me the other day that you can actually get other things other than jam donuts. Now, goodness only knows, apparently there's a donut shop that sells nothing but donuts. I have no idea. But this lot, I'm doing a time now, so I'll let you know how long it's taking to get to what point. Start the timer now. Five minutes now. I'm starting to wonder if that top heater element is working. I'll turn them over. I turned them over two minutes ago. So. Starting to brown a little bit. So another minute now, so that's eight minutes. Yeah. Right, what I'm gonna do from now on, five minutes, turn it over, three minutes the other way. And I'm gonna do that with the rest of that mix. There we have it. Now they all came out pretty much like that. Now I've got to do the topping. So, my wife says that you can buy donuts with all sorts of different toppings. 
So I'm gonna make my own. Right, to begin with, icing sugar. Now, so I know what is what, I'm going to put a little bit of green colouring in this one. Um, cap full of green. And a cap full of vanilla flavour. So I think that's it. For my second topping, start off with icing sugar again. This one, I'm going to add a capful of salted caramel. Now, for my third topping, I'm going to need some jalapenos. Some sriracha. Sauce and a bit more hot sauce. And whack that on the whirly gig. It's now time to do a bit of di dipping. So. And of course, the hot sauce. And I'll leave those two to taste without anything on it. My wife just came out and told me that I got the icing all wrong and she mixed this one up to show me. So I chucked a bit more in these made them a lot harder. Got these back out. My life this is a messy affair. And of course, the last part to this culinary delight.
an all-important taste test. Now to begin with, I'll go for an unflavoured one. It's okay, um, it doesn't taste like any donut I've ever eaten before, but then again, they are always got jam in them, so. Next we'll go for a vanilla. Probably could have done with a little bit more vanilla in there. I could still taste the um, icing sugar. Now, the salted caramel. Mm. Mm. Got the flavour in perfect on that. Now, of course, the most important one of all, the hot sauce. Hmm. Those two hot sauces were in sort of um, Tesco's and places like that. Father's Day's imitation hot sauce. So just really no guts to them at all, do you? Tabasco sauce is warmer than they are. So add in those jalapenos, give them a little lift. Mm. I like them. As you see, I had to keep it all apart, so Nothing affected anything else, especially this one, because if I want people to try these, then that can't be anywhere near it, just in case. Um, I've had a look at that machine, and both elements are working, but I don't think the top one's working as well as the bottom, because it's, you know, I have to keep turning it over to try and cook it. So, it's alright, it's alright, but... It's a shame that it's not cooking both top and bottom at the same speed. Anyhow, I hope you enjoyed this. And I'm going to take this away and find out if anybody wants to try it. So I'll get Bob to let you know. Thank you so much for watching. See you again next time. Ta-da! And a Satsuma pill. Don't be orange pill, but I haven't got an orange. And a Satsuma pill. So we'll chuck some of those in as well. Do me a favor, don't tell my wife.